How to add a number counter to your Squarespace website. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. I'm going to show you everything step-by-step. -step. So, if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to add a number counter to your Squarespace website. Okay, so to do this, the first thing that you need to do is go to the first link in the description of this video. Click on this link right here. And that is going to take you over to this website called Elfsight. Now, Elfsight is a software that allows us to have access to widgets and tools that we wouldn't usually be able to get through Squarespace alone. And one of these tools is a number counter that we can add to Squarespace. Now, the awesome thing about Elfsight is the fact that you can sign up for free. So all you need to do is enter your email in right here. Click on start and then you will be able to go ahead and sign up for your Elfsight account. Now, once that is done, once you have signed up for Elfsight, all you need to do is click on widgets at the top. And as you can see here, these are all of the widgets that you can get on Elfsight. So you might want to play around with these and add a few of these to your website to see if you would like to use them. However, we are specifically going for the number counter. So the easiest way to do this is just go back to the top and in the search bar, search for number, and then we can select the number counter. So go ahead and click on this. And then as you can see, it then asks us to choose one of these templates. So there's a lot of templates to choose from right here. Um, go ahead and just choose one of these. I'm going to go for this one. And then once the template has been selected, just click on continue. We can then edit all of these, so we can go into here, and we can say like 5,690 five-star reviews, and you can change the caption as well. You can then change the icon right here, and everything like that. You can also add new counters if you would like. Um, I personally don't like this because I think it looks better just with four. If you want to change the color or anything like that, you can absolutely go ahead and do this as well. However, I do like the idea of blue, like I would recommend to do this in blue, just because blue is like the colour of trust if you look into colour psychology. So having this as blue is a very good idea. Now, once all of this has been customised and this looks how you want it to look, all we then have to do is click on add to website for free. It's then going to save the widget and show us like a preview of how this is going to look. And then all we need to do is click on publish at the top. From here, it's then going to ask you to pick a plan. So the plan that you go for depends on how many monthly website views you get. So you can go ahead and choose one of these plans. However, if you're new to Squarespace or if you just want to test out Elfsight, then you can go for the free plan right here. Once you have selected which plan you would like to go with, it's going to take you through to this screen where it's going to give you this piece of code. Now from here, it is super simple, literally just a case of copy and paste. So all we need to do is copy the code right here, go back over to Squarespace, and then obviously make sure that we're in the editor so that we can do this. We want to add a section. So choose where you want to add in the number counter. And when you add a section, super important, make sure this is a blank section. So we go ahead and add this. And then all we have to do from here is click on add block in the top left corner. From all of these options, click on code. And then we can double tap on this. Obviously delete what is already here. Simply paste in what we just copied. Now, as you can see, we have this embed script thing. If we just basically stretch this out and make this the size that we want. You can see this embed script. Um, effectively, this only shows up in editing. So if we back out of the editor and, of course, on the actual site, it's not going to show this and this is how it's going to look. It's just going to show the number counters right here, just like that. And that is how you can add a number counter to your Squarespace website. 